Okay, so this is a video on how you can clone our repository and run our code, the new money direction code on your HiMax V1 board. So I'm doing this on a Windows machine right now, but the same can be followed on uh, using a Linux machine as well as a Mac OS machine. So in Windows, I'm using git bash for uh, co copying the terminal commands on it. So first of all, uh, you need to fire up your browser and go to this GitHub link, which is shared in the description of the video. And then uh, you can go onto this code one, this uh, download option. You can either download the zip file, which I would highly suggest to not to do the same as because there will be, a, you might face some kind of issues in doing that. Uh, so using the HTTPS one, uh, I'm copying this. Then I'm going to the git bash one, I will click git clone. Okay, so I will paste this one. Uh, I've copied the code and then I will click on enter. We will wait for a couple of minutes, uh, not minutes actually, seconds for downloading it. It depends on your network speed. So here you can see that uh, it had downloaded the, the entire repository as a file, as a folder from GitHub. And then I will uh, CD and LS those things to get to know that where are those stuffs. Okay, so I've cleared up the screen again to get a better look for you guys. Uh, I have also increasing the size so that you guys will be able to see a bit more clearly. Okay, seems to be going good. And then uh, what I will do is that I will press LS and this will open up a lot of stuff, a lot of folders and other stuff that you're having on your machine. So I will go to this one, which is our pneumonia detection edge ML. Uh, this one, the, the repository name of it. So what I will do is that I will remember this one. You can even copy paste this stuff. Then I will click on CD, uh, pneumonia detection. Uh, normal direction edge ML. I will click on that, and there you go. We are into the repository. I will clear up the screen again. Cool. So I will press LS now and check what are the stuff that we are having. Uh, it's logs.png, this file this file up here. And then there are the, the folders inside it, the Harmus library, the readme images, readme videos, as a library and the license and the readme inside it. So we are deploying this as uh, on the high max uh, V1 board. So we need to, uh, you know, open up the repository and flash up uh, the high max V1 from the high max library. And if you are doing the same using on your browser, uh, for example, developing on your browser as a JavaScript thingy, then uh, what you need to do is that you need to again clone up this repository rather than I would suggest you can obviously go with downloading it as a zip file but I would suggest not to do that it becomes much much easier when doing this process rather than downloading it as a zip uh, then you can do up as a version library and compile it and then run on your browser uh, but now we are doing it as a HiMax library so what I will do is that I will click on HiMax dot library and we are inside it. Uh, let me clear the screen again. Click on LS to see what are the things we are having. We are having edge impulse firmware.img, flash windows.bat, hiamax.txt. So these are the flash linux.sh and flash max.command. So what you need to do is that you need to click on either flash windows.bat for your uh, for running from your uh, Windows machine for, for flashing it from your Windows machine and the Linux one is for a Linux machine and the Mac follows for a Mac one. And yeah, this was it. This is the pretty easy, uh, a pretty small video of how you can clone a repository and then run on it. Uh, I will try to make a new video uh, on how you can completely flash up your IMAX V1 and do direction stuff from it uh, for 
detecting pneumonia from our repository so thanks for watching this video and don't forget to like it if you wanna be come uh, wanna run this repository wanna run this code and if you are facing any kind of the issues you're obviously feel free to drop them in the chat or either on the issues tab up and get up uh thank you